Hello teachers, in this brief video I'll show you how to get started creating your Glogster introduction which is part one of our assignment in week one. Each class I make a new Glogster. Learning is transformative and our lives continually change so I hope if you have time that you look through to see the differences in what I've created. What I'd like for you to do first is I'm going to copy the class code so that you've got that. Now I'm going to go to glogster.com and they've made a little bit of a change here so now we go to get started. The account that fits for you is you are a student. Enter that code then provide your name and then and then a password. So I'm just putting in my grandchildren's names. Pre-made templates for you in different areas. However, I like to use the blank templates because I like to put my own information in. To make certain that I include the information that is asked for in the instructions, I make my headings first and then I will rearrange the information around my Glogster. When you're adding text, you can copy information and you don't have to start back from square one. So I'm going to put my content area, grade level, and put that somewhere. But as you'll probably see, my family, my hobbies, and you can see how you can change the size. This is all I'm going to show you. I want you to be creative on your own. I will have more information. I just wanted to get you started here, but there you can add videos, um, audio. So I hope that you have as much fun creating your Glogster as I do each year. Thanks for listening and thanks for learning.